travel delays and cancellations can be a nightmare. Just ask Michael Harris, who had a tough time traveling to Medford last week. They told me, oh, your flight is canceled. And they said, well, we're going to get you out of here at 1030 tomorrow morning. Now the Federal Aviation Administration has been forced to make major budget cuts. Because of the sequester, FAA officials say they have no choice but to put 15,000 air traffic controllers on furlough, which started on Sunday. Meaning with a smaller amount of employees, delays could stack up from just a few minutes to up to four hours. The actions could also potentially delay as many as 6,700 flights a day. However, it appears as if the FAA furloughs won't directly impact the Rogue Valley. Our tower is a contracted FAA tower, which means that they're not FAA employees. Our contract is not, has not been in jeopardy for closure. They haven't reduced forces, so our tower is operating real, really well. Flights in and out of Medford do travel to some of the major cities who will be affected. As for Harris, who's traveling back to Southern California, he hopes he can avoid the delays by only traveling through the smaller airports. See if I can find a, you know, go out to Long Beach, or Palm Springs, see if they got a one-hop flight. At the Rogue Valley International Medford Airport, Kyle Laverman, NBC5 News.